Happy Sunday morning, everyone. Um, I got this word on the 6th, and I'm going to go ahead and put it up today. Um, please prayerfully discern this word and every word you hear, and I will go ahead and read this. It says, My daughter, write my words for those with ears to hear. My children, today is like any, is unlike any other day. Today can be the day that you start anew, a fresh anointing, a fresh awakening, bringing you into my perfect love, peace, and joy. Today is a day that you can draw from my strength. The only thing that prevents you from receiving these things from me is belief in the lies of the enemy. He will tell you that I am a God of ven vengeance. Do I seek vengeance over my own? He will say that I do not hear or answer prayers. These are lies. His goal is to bind you in fear and prevent my power from working in and through you. I say, have no fear, my loves, for it is by my strength that you will conquer every giant. Though he may mount up an angry army of his minions against my body. You have already won the victory, my loves. It is his lies that convince you otherwise. This is where your faith is needed, my loves. For just because you can't see the victory does not mean that it hasn't already been won. My faith, I'm sorry, have faith, my children, that if your heart belongs to me and you are walking in faith, all things in your life and the promotion of my kingdom will work together for good. Do not become impatient, my children, for timing. My timing is not your timing. If you are impatient, you are impotent. You need to have faith in me, my loves, for the faith the size of a mustard seed can move a mountain. You are not beholden to the ways of this world, my children. You cannot allow this world to mold and shape you. If you subject yourself to this world, you will be bombarded with his lies. You cannot accept defeat when the problems of this world seem insurmountable. The realities you see with your eyes are only as real as you allow them to be in your heart and if you believe you have been defeated you are not walking in faith i have been calling forth my warriors for many years and i have an entire army of faithful soldiers that i have prepared to march forward in my strength my hand is upon these and no matter what comes against them they will not surrender these have come to know that my plans cannot be defeated and that even though they may appear ragtag and defeated, they will not stop marching forward. My power resides in their hearts, and nothing will stop them from carrying out my victory. My army knows in their hearts it's already been won. These wear my armor, and to them defeat is not even a word in their vocabulary. No matter how bad things may appear, their hearts are set upon my victory. They know the only direction is forward. I invite all that know me to become part of this army. It is never too late to join my ranks. My victory on the cross of Calvary justifies, vindicates, and is indisputable. My children have inherited by their birthright not only a place in my glorious kingdom, but righteous standing upon your earth yesterday, today, and forever. Complete faith in my victory is required for all my soldiers. For the battles the enemy places before my own are meant to weaken and remove faith in me. He wishes to trample upon the hearts of my end time remnant, and his only weapons are lies to induce fear. Resist his lies, my children. He wishes to cause dissension among my ranks and wishes to divide my people. 
He facilitates, promotes, and brings forth many liars and many lies. My children, your discernment is required. If you believe that I cannot control outcomes, if you believe my hand cannot be lifted against the enemy, you are not believing in me. Your faith is weak and your heart is far from me. You are believing his lies and you are being fooled. Today is the day that you can draw from my strength. Today is the day you can join my ranks. Allow me to crush his lies and the fear that comes along with them. It's called faith. It's faith that it has been finished. I love you, my children. Yeshua HaMashiach.